This is version 2.0 of my LED matrix handbag. And what's a nice improvement in this version over the last version is that the LED matrix is on a separate panel that actually can be zipped out of the lining. Uh, and it's held in place by magnets, so you can actually just pop it right out, like so. It's completely removable. Unhook the magnets. And as you see, there's the matrix. Uh, the electronics are inside a 3D printed box. There's an Adafruit Feather BLE module in here. And the power is just provided by one of those 5 volt USB battery chargers. And because it's held in place by magnets, it's really easy to put back. Or you could uh, sew a separate handbag or any kind of garment and use the same, reuse the same matrix. But I'll show you how easy it is to put it back. You just pop it right back in the zipper interior, get the magnets to line up, and snap them back in place. And voila, there you have it. One nice feature about using the Adafruit Bluetooth module as the uh, controller for the bag is that it can be accessed through this Blue Fruit app they've released. So you can see right here, I've opened up the app and I'm connecting it to the module and I can actually communicate uh, via UART. You can also communicate um, through different methods. They have a controller with buttons, uh, but I've set it up to communicate via text delivered through the UART. So if I type in commands, and I've programmed it to accept commands beginning with exclamation points. So I type in exclamation point N for next. It sets the purse to the next animation in the sequence. And there's several animations. I can cycle through them by typing in exclamation point N several times. You can see some of the different animations that and that's one of my favorites that's Conway's Game of Life. All right and more animations. And we're back to the original sine wave animation. Uh, another thing I can do is set the brightness with the command beginning with exclamation point B for brightness and a number from 1 to 255. So if I set the brightness to 10, it should get a lot dimmer. You can see that it did. And I'll set it back to uh, 100. Oops. To get it where it was. B 100. And uh, we can also change the color palette. Uh, there are several different color palettes pre-programmed in there. If I type in the command exclamation point PAL, it'll switch to a different color palette. You can see that one is a palette of mostly reds. Oops. I can do a different palette. Put some yellows and greens in there. So those are different features I can access through a UART text via the Blue Fruit app. In addition to uh, sending commands to the handbag through the Blue Fruit app, it can also take text via the UART feed, which is programmed to get displayed directly on the LED matrix. So I can type in text like, say, geek mom rocks and send that directly to the handbag and it will display, I have it set to display three times in a random color each time. So that's kind of a fun feature as well. One final feature of the Adafruit Blue Fruit app that's really nice is the ability to connect to an MQTT feed. I have my own Mosquito server running on a Raspberry Pi uh, which has an MQTT feed, and I have it set up so that if anybody tweets with a hashtag Twitter bag, 
it actually uh, sends the contents of the tweet uh, out via an MQTT message to a particular topic. And I can actually subscribe to that topic in the uh, Bluefruit app through this icon at the top of the Bluefruit app. So here's the um, my MQTT server and it subscribes to a particular topic right there. And we can actually demonstrate it. Uh, if I go to my Twitter feed here and write a new tweet, let's call it hi there and add the hashtag Twitter bag. Ignore that notification that just popped up. Twitter bag and tweet it out. It may take a second, but the text of the tweet should actually show up as a UART message and get displayed on the handbag, and there it is. It defaults to repeating three times. And you can set up your Mosquito server to send whatever messages you want. So you can actually get messages um, of all kinds um, through your phone via um, MQTT. So that's kind of a nice feature of the Bluefruit app. So if you liked this LED matrix handbag project and want to read up a little bit more about how it was constructed, there's a link in the um, description of this video to my blog and you can look at the write-up there. I hope you've enjoyed this project. I certainly enjoyed making it. Thanks!